Hello, and welcome to a Teacher Center tutorial on how to use Adobe Voice. First, pick a story structure. There's lots to choose from. Scroll left or right with your finger. By tapping on Layout at the top of the screen, you'll be able to decide how your content will appear for this slide. Next, tap on the Themes pull-down, and you can decide a whole bunch of different backgrounds. Tap on the Music pull-down menu for a variety of different background songs. To adjust the volume, slide the bar from left to right. When you're ready to tell your story, press and hold the microphone at the bottom. When you're done, release your finger from the microphone. Simple visuals and text help tell a great story. When you're ready, click the plus sign. Choose between icons, photos, and text. When you tap on the icon button, you can search for thousands of free pictures. I typed in iPad. It returned dozens of choices. When you tap on the Photos icon, Adobe Voice will access your camera roll and all the pictures that you have stored on your iPad. When you tap on the Text icon, you can add any text you want. After you've added all your pictures and told your story, it's time to share with the world. Like so many other apps, just tap the Export button to share. It's in the top right corner. Edit the category information as necessary, then choose how you'd like to share your story. Who knows how far your story might be told, but at least now Adobe Voice has helped you share it. I hope you have found this Teacher Center tutorial helpful.